Alright everybody, welcome back. So in this tutorial we're going to cover uh, the network scanning portion of the penetration test. Um, instead of going through and um, scanning the whole subnet to try and find Metasploitable 2, um, we're just, we're just going to um, use the ifconfig command here on Metasploitable and um, just grab our um, IP address that way. Um, before you do that, one thing that you should do is, if you're using or um, VirtualBox, come here to your network settings and change it to a host-only adapter um, for both Kali and Metasploitable. So um, you'll probably have to restart your machines um, when you do that, but first off, just make sure you do that. Um, do not put it onto a bridged network. Because uh, that'll expose that'll expose Metasploitable to the internet, which you don't really want to have happen. So, all right. So right here we've got our Kali Linux virtual machine. On the right we've got Metasploitable. So first thing we're going to do is we're just going to ping uh, Metasploitable just to make sure that we're able to access it. So um, we'll just do 192.168.56.103. Yours will obviously be a little different. Um, so we were, we are able to reach that, so that's good. We're going to go ahead and do just the basic nmap scan on this one. We'll do nmap 156, or sorry, 168, 36, 103. So while that's running, we in previous tutorials have gone over nmap in depth. So if you have any questions about nmap, be sure to check that out. Uh, the other thing that we're going to talk, okay, there we go. So, um, so nmap comes back and gave us a list of um, all of these ports that are open. So we've got an open FTP, FTP, SSH, Telnet, um, and and lots of others. Um, there's also one that's unknown. We don't know what service is running on that port. Um, so. That's what nmap does, and of course nmap can go um, far more in depth. Uh, there's another tool with, already built into Kali called Armitrage, so I'm going to go ahead and click that and open it up. Um, Armitrage is basically a GUI that combines um, nmap and Metasploit, so go ahead and just click yes. Metasploit, if you're not aware, is a hacking framework um, that's updated daily. Um, and so it's it's more on um, the script kitty side of things, but it is a really good way um, to um, to start off. So uh, the attack computer um, okay. So we're gonna go ahead and I have some previous um, hosts up. Whoops. We're going to go ahead and delete these. Um, sorry about that. I didn't realize these were going to be here. Let me go ahead and get rid of those. Um, so while I'm doing this, go ahead and take a look around um, at the various uh, things that Armitrage can do. Um, here on the left, these are the different types of Metasploit um, payloads or exploits. Um, and so these will come in handy in a little bit in the next tutorial. So let's go ahead and let's add a host. Um, we already know it's IP address. We're just going to put that in. Okay, and then click add, whatever your IP address is. Um, and then you should have this box pop up. So the first thing that we want to do is we want to scan it. And to do that, we're going to come here and we'll go to hosts and map scan. And then here it'll give us several different options. So let's do a quick scan with OS detection. Um, it should come back um, and give us some good info on that. So um, let's that, let that run again. Um, you can see what type of scan nmap is running. It gives you the command right here. Um, and so you could copy and paste that in. Okay, so it completed the scan, um, 
and it found out what version they are um, and all the other info, all the open ports, the MAC address, um, what type of Linux version it's running. Um, if we want to go even more in depth, we can do um, a comprehensive scan on our Metasploitable machine. So we can go ahead and click that. Um, so if you notice, each time you run a command, a different tab down here pops up. So here you've got, um, this is our old Nmap scan, this is our new Nmap scan. Um, and it's going to run for a while, so we're just going to ignore that. So with that, that concludes um, this tutorial on network uh, scanning. And in the next one, we'll talk about some ways that you can exploit my disploitable.